Hello everybody, this is Ashya Farpal Singh Sokhi and I'm here to make your breakfast more interesting. Yeah, every time you wake up in the morning, you think what to cook now. So I'm going to make you vermicelli upma. This is also my favorite. I've got whole wheat vermicelli here, which is the fine vermicelli. Uh, you get different varieties. You can use any variety you want. And for this, I'm going to fry the vermicelli first. A little bit of oil in this about three to four tablespoons it takes a lot of oil when you fry the vermicelli it actually gives you a better taste so that's what i'm going to do here first fry the vermicelli and then make the upma so as the oil heats up we need to add the vermicelli in here and saute the vermicelli once it is lightly brown take this out in a bowl and in another wok kadai that i've got little bit of oil heat it up add mustard seeds to this one teaspoon add raw peanuts about one fourth cup so as the mustard seeds splutter and the peanuts become lightly brown you can see them they split in between and uh, you see it browning we need to add curry leaves 15 20 of them we need to add some green chilies chopped about three green chilies chopped to this and I'm going to add chopped onions about two of them small numbers and saute this now and once you sweat the onions you don't need to brown them we'll add tomatoes two tomatoes salt to taste there you go Turmeric, half a teaspoon, red chili powder, half a teaspoon, green peas and everything I'm going to saute for another four to five minutes. After sauteing about four to five minutes, I'm going to add water and bring the water to a boil before I add the vermicelli. So as the water comes to a boil, I'm going to add all the vermicelli in this and soak this up and leave it up for some time so that the vermicelli gets soft and gets cooked well. So water should completely dry up and then you have a great vermicelli upma ready to you know indulge for breakfast. So as the water dries up with the help of a fork or a spoon like this I will just mix this up and cook further until the water is absolutely evaporated. As the water evaporates completely, the vermicelli still would look little wet, but don't worry about it. As you keep it for some time and it gets little cooler, you will see that it separates up. What I've used is absolute fine variety of vermicelli, hence you will see the threads uh, very, very fine and not separate like you would probably see in spaghetti. You also get little thicker variety which you can use for breakfast. Now to serve, I've got this fantastic, wow, look at this, beautiful. And finally, some fresh coriander on top. And there you go, beautiful vermicelli upma for breakfast, getting you the change that you require from your regular routine that you would be making at home. If you like all my recipes and you love the way I cook, then don't forget to subscribe my channel. And don't forget to press the bell icon for regular updates.